Every year you, mm -hmm. in, in the White House, we get about 560 some white Indian chiefs, which in history they call $5 Indians because 90% of the people calling themselves Indians nowadays are not, are not really Indians. Those are whites passing as Indians because they paid $5 to the Dawes Commission to get their name on the Dawes Roll so they can get all these advantages. Mm -hmm. But every year they get invited to the White House. <coughs> and every year they got an approximately three hundred three and a half billion dollars every year, even that Obama's been in office. They got money into the Federal Indian Bureau. Now see, if you were to talk about reparations, black folks have been getting all this money all these years too. But they got shut out because the Indians in 1938, they sent, to, they sent a letter to the to the Department of Bureau of Indian Affairs saying, how do we shut black folk down to make sure they never get any reparations? And that, that, that letter floated around in, in, the, in the federal government from about 1938 to about 1941. Then it went to the Secretary for the Department of Interior. And the Department of Interior looked and says, aha, said, how do I come up with a scheme to shut down blacks so they get no reparations in this country? He said, what you do, you Indians come up with a new concept called a quantum blood law which says that black folk are not entitled to any of the benefits of the 1866 treaty yeah. in terms of reparations yeah. unless they can prove beyond a shadow of a doubt that they got one quarter Indian blood in them. Yeah. And we make Indian blood sacred like, like Jesus Christ's blood. And therefore, they've been shutting blacks out all these years. That's why they didn't get any reparations. To go back to your earlier point. And the last point on reparations, you asked me earlier about a blueprint. This country's always given reparations to <coughs> all groups except black folk, even though black folk were the ones who built the country. They built the bridges, they picked the cotton, they built the highways, they built the government buildings. They were the backbone of this nation. But now, so in, in, the, in the Marshall Plan, we gave billions of dollars to, uh, to, to, the, to, the, to Germans after World War II. We got under, under what's called a point uh, four program. We, we gave reparations to, to Japan, Japan, Japanese. We gave reparations to American Indians. We gave reparations to everybody but black folk. Yet black folk are locked into the bottom of a vertical order and a descending order of wealth, owning, and poverty, I mean, and, and control of resources, and nobody wants to address the issue.